Hello YouTube friends, this is Tiago with another maths video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to prove that when you have a shape made up of two isosceles triangles like this and an apex of x plus y, the angle at the center over here outside of this shape made up of the two isosceles triangles will be 2 times x plus y. In other words, the angle over here outside of the shape is going to be double the value of the angle at the apex of this shape over here, which is x plus y. So, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to prove that this is the case. Now, what makes this proof possible is that the angles within a triangle in two-dimensional space add up to 180 degrees. Also, halfway around a circle is 180 degrees. Okay? So these two facts make it possible for us to come up with this proof. So with the logic that I've just described, it is fair to say that 2x, two of these angles over here, plus the angle A, add up to 180 degrees. It is also fair to say that 2y plus b, so two of these angles over here, plus the angle b is equal to 180 degrees. Now what makes these two equations possible is the fact that we're dealing with two isosceles triangles. As we can see on this triangle above, we have two lengths of r, which is radius. And likewise, for this triangle below, we have two lengths of r, which is radius. Okay, to get our proof, we will have to find the value of a and also the value of b. So we're going to be using the information that we've written down over here to come up with these values. Let's first get the value of a. So we've got 2x plus a is equal to 180 degrees. This means that a is going to be equal to 180 degrees minus 2x. Okay? Now let's get the value of b. B is going to be equal to 180 degrees, okay, minus 2y. Now, because we know that halfway around a circle is 180 degrees, we can get the angle beside A over here, outside of the shape, and the angle next to B, outside of the shape. And these new angles combined should be 2 times x plus y over here. And if we can prove this, we've finalized our proof. What we can do is call this angle over here C. Okay? and we can call this angle over here D. We are going to look for the value of C plus D, and we are going to try to prove that it's double X plus Y. So let's say that A plus C is equal to 180 degrees. This is because halfway around the circle is 180 degrees. 
This is going to mean that C is equal to 180 degrees minus A. And this is the same as 180 degrees minus 180 degrees minus 2x. This will give us 180 degrees minus 180 degrees plus 2x. And because these two cancel each other out, what we're left with is 2x. Okay, so C is equal to 2x. Once again, because halfway around the circle is 180 degrees, we can say that B plus D is 180 degrees. Okay, let's write this down over here. B plus D is 180 degrees. This will mean that D is 180 degrees minus B. Okay, and B is in fact 180 degrees minus 2y. Okay, we have this written down up here. If we simplify this equation, we get 180 degrees minus 180 degrees plus 2y. And these two cancel each other out. So what we're left with is D is equal to 2y. Now we've established that C is equal to 2x and that D is equal to 2y. So what is C plus D? C plus D is going to be equal to 2x plus 2y. And this is equal to 2 times x plus y. Okay, and we have our proof. This is because 2 times x plus y is double the angle of this apex up here. Therefore, we've proven that C plus D is equal to 2 times x plus y. And we've finalized our proof. If you've enjoyed this video and want more mathematics proofs, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. Also, if you want more mathematics proofs, visit mathematics.proofs on Instagram. Here you're going to find loads of GCSE and A-level mathematics proofs. Thank you very much indeed for watching this video, and I'll talk to you again soon.